What's up you guys, Idiot Fliptronics. I'm going to be showing you guys how to use private browsing on your iPhone 7 or iPhone 7 Plus. So, uh, you know, with privacy being such an issue these days, this is definitely, you know, something that most people might want to try out. So anyways, it's pretty easy, you guys. You just got to open Safari. Um, you know, when you're in Safari, you want to go down to the bottom tabs right here and click on the one all the way to the bottom right. So this is, you know, when it's going to open the new tabs or whatever, but you're going to see an option towards the bottom that says private, little plus icon, and then done. So at this point, what you guys want to do is click private, but you're not quite done yet. So just click private. Okay, so then it's going to pull up this private browsing mode. It says Safari won't remember pages you visited, your search history, your autofill info. So just... uh click done when you do that so then you're gonna see the background you know kinda change to like a kinda like a gray this will keep you in private browsing so uh, this is cool you know basically because you know if you're someone who doesn't want to have Safari you know keep your history you won't have to worry about clearing it out ever because it's all gonna be um, you know in a in private mode and then it won't keep your uh, cookies or cache either uh, if you guys ever want to switch back and get out of it all you would have to do is unclick private and then click done and it will take you back out of private browsing but um, it's just a nice feature you guys and I think that uh, you know some people might want to use this just because privacy is such a big concern for most people these days but um, as always you guys uh, you know if you haven't subscribed to our channel would definitely appreciate it if you get did and uh, stay tuned for more